we will start the recording. So uh, I will ask you questions, but first I would like you to introduce yourself. Okay. To speak a little bit about you, about uh, your art. Okay, my name is uh, Min Wu. Uh, I'm a, a doctor in Chinese medicine. And yes. I also been learning and practice Tai Chi all my life for more than 40 years. I teach in the U.S. for 30 years. I uh, come from China, Southern China. Southern China. I come here uh, 1989. In 89, yes. 1989, I come to Massachusetts first, then I moved to live in Connecticut 10 years ago. Wonderful, very nice. And uh, let's speak a little bit about Qigong and Tai Chi. And let's see, you see nowadays a lot of people, they have problems with the posture because they sit in a wrong way where, uh, while driving, so how can Qigong, Tai Chi, and even Chinese medicine can help with the improving the posture? Yeah, Qigong and Tai Chi, because the, you have to follow uh, our principle of practice Tai Chi, Qigong. The main principle of Qigong practice is to remind yourself every minute is aligned with your body. That's called the Zhen. Zhen means the top point, the governor twenty and the Kong. Subpension, you have to lie on the top of the head. Yeah, not when you stand up, you cooking, or you sitting, even you lay down, you your alignment let a lot of the energy flow. It when your energy flow, she no tension, no stress. That's doesn't matter what you do. You work in one hour, ten hour, ten hour, no different. So in order yeah. the energy to flow, we need to be aligned. Yeah, aligned. You, you open up. It in the center of the channel or or open. She does the training. That's why it's a qigong tai chi training. You alignment your posture and you remind yourself. And when you alignment, then you feel good. You can focus on who you are, what you want. I mean, many people because any get blocked. They don't have good posture. Then you any get stuck. That's why the monkey might come to them. They worry about all the problem because they don't feel good. You don't oh. feel good, that's why the monkey, monkey might attach to you. You feel good, you, I'm air, I'm light, I'm water flow, nothing bother you. Doesn't matter what kind of news, good, good news, bad news, it's just different news, whatever. Well, so wonderful this, this theory, this image that you created. Thank you. And uh, you see many people, they have uh, inner tensions, even in the muscles or sometimes in the mind, as you say, the monkey mind. How can Qigong and Tai Chi help to reduce all this tension, to, de to detense, to, to relax? Yeah, to relax. You see, it's because Tai Chi Qigong is involved with two basic training. One is train your body to be alignment. Second, train your mind, the mind powerful. You train your mind to put intention on what you want. And that Qigong and Tai Chi, all the school, they have a technique to train the practitioner to get what you want. That's why that's mm -hmm. how the body and mind connected. But body is the foundation. You train the body center. Then the mind come in. Mind come in it connect to the body, then you put whatever you want it. And that the mindset plus the skill set equals the success. That the body is a skill. Like Gong Hu, Tai yeah. Chi, we have a posture, then we have movement, meditation, motion, then we have mind, mind, go your mind, go quiet. When you go quiet, blend, you go, say I'm light, you become light, nothing nothing there and you create you you are the creator you can create whatever you need it and that means it's like self-hypnosis is so powerful you remind yourself what you need is the if people worry about problem then they get a problem you focus on what you need what you want but you have to know who you are then you know what you need what you want but instead of someone will tell you what you need what you want american ron duncan there's a marketing out there this is all the fear it's a 
fear business. They scare you. That's truck you to the wrong way. But you just let go. You become who you are and you know what you want. You make your choice. It's for your belief. It's a for your belief. But they say, no, you cannot go that way. That way, is they scare you. You cannot go your way. But my way is better than your way. They say, you go your way, go to hell. I just say, my hell is better than your heaven. It's many ways to go. But they say, no, this is the only way to do it. That's a corporation. They want to sell something or marketing something to you. That's called marketing. Marketing, they get somebody of power and marketing you to the wrong way. In that Tai Chi Qi Gong, there's Tao. The Tao is nothing. It's all yours. All yours. But they say no. Yes. Uh, Even evil now. People have power too. Evil people have so much power, but you let go. Nothing afraid on you. I see. Them, them, the, the, that's why stress free. No stress. Even now, listening to you and seeing you, I feel the energy flow. It's, it's amazing. It's, it's very nice. Wonderful. <laughs> And uh, let's see, the next question will be, how can we improve the briefing and strengthen the, na the lungs through Qigong exercises and Tai Chi? Yeah, breathing is very important in Qigong. See, we talk about mind and body technique. Then we have breathing technique. That's the three element, element three techniques in the Qigong. So the next technique, breathing. Breathing, that means they have to be uh, calmed down first. They may first begin the level, they have to pay attention from the sinus breathing here. When you pay attention, you can listen and watch it. Awareness, the air in and out. Instead, focus on all the monkey mind. Monkey mind, they just pass by, but if you focus here, come down first. Your eyes just a little bit open when you're meditating, but not close. Close is what happens. People, many people grow asleep. They just Close down a little bit. That's get to pay attention here. Help you coming down. That's the upper dantian, the energy system. Yeah. Center. Then you connect to here. Then you walk past the nose down to middle dantian, CV17, that's the point here, in the center of the chest, the heart. Then you put in pay attention to below your back button, about an uh, elbow side. That's the lower dantian. That's for get your strength. And it's the body and mind, spirit, all become one. That's why you do breathing. Breathing, you restore your energy. Your chi is strong. You're strong. Nobody bother you. The tiger not bother you because they can feel your energy strong. Only when your chi weak, the negative energy, they can pick on you. That's called the best way to win the war is without, without killing. Like cancer shell, they come and go, I don't need to kill the cancer. I don't need to kill, kill the flu or the cure because my chi is strong. Our body have a tool. Like Western, we have T shell. We have a killing shell. And in Chinese medicine, we call it the Wei Qi. Wei Qi, your, your energy is part of your energy. is the body gut. Your body gut, security system so strong. Why worry? Because if you worry, people worry because your chi weak. That's why you need breathing. And I will live with our Oxygen, we need high oxygen, we need chi, that's create the power. Like your car, you need oxygen coming, the air coming, and the gasoline and the electric become the power of the car move. Our body is a similar idea. We need oxygen, we need nutrition, good food, good water, and uh, okay. combine together. Then sometimes it's just we move, when we move, then Everything come by, the power come. And you feel the power, you're not afraid because people are weak. That's why the monkey bite get them. That's why we need, the reason we need breathing also is many studies done in past hundred years. It's high oxygen, like even cancer cell, they cannot uh, survive in high oxygen. The cancer cell, they come and go. Of course, everybody have cancer. Is they not grow too much, not bother us, leave them alone. Yes, yes, yes. They're balanced. Good cell and thin cell is balanced. Like good boy and bad boy is balanced. If good boy is strong, the bad boy not bother. Why kill all the bad boy? Sooner or later, they're going to wake up, right? <laughs> you just do as an example. Better than kill the bad boy. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's the breathing. That's why breathing is very important. Many people forget to breathe. When you hurry, the monkey bite, they to run. Hurry, hurry. Then you, you forget how to do the breathing. That's why weaken their body. That's why, 
like the the the, the car, the the system not working. That's why the car designed for six hundred thousand miles. Some people burn out in two hundred thousand miles. It's not that not done yet. It's you so true. You use your body like the car have a menu, right? But the our body created no menu. You have to figure it out yourself. That's why we need Tai Chi Chi Gong. See the car, you have a menu for how do you maintenance them, right? But our body have a menu doesn't come with you, but you have to learn about your menu yourself, create your menu. Wonderful. I wish everyone who listened to these words to share this wisdom. Thank you. And let's see now, you see, as you said, that people are running all over and their energy goes weak. So nowadays, a lot of people, they are stressed. They don't know how to reduce this stress. So probably the same principle will apply. Yes, that's why we do Tai Chi Chi Gong. We've been doing this for many thousand years in China, go back to 5,000 years ago. And the old technique is still very good. We, can, we, 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 have, we, we can have a technology, it's new, but new, we have that information, but if you apply the old technique, you ground yourself, you don't get lost on the ocean of the, all the information. You can pick whatever you need, instead of all this information like attached to you. You just go, you take whatever you need. That, but still, we need to keep the old, old, old technique. Old technique is still always good. Yeah. Okay, integrate. Like business right now, you use Zoom. That's a technology now we can do interview like this, long distance. Yes, wonderful. But still, yes. we have to go ourselves not get lost on too many technologies. You just use whatever you need. It's true. Balance, yet, right? As you said, uh, we have to keep what it's proven to be useful, not to give it up. Like we keep the Qigong and the Tai Chi. Yes. Yes, yes. And uh, through Qigong and Tai Chi, do we arrive to know our, to know our body better? Do we arrive to to feel our, to listen to our body, to have a feedback from our body. How does it work? To, Excuse me, Yes, I'm going to repeat. So, uh, through practicing Qigong and Tai Chi, are we able to better know our body, to listen to our body, to listen to any signal that our body sends to us, so we can uh, fix some problems that they appear? Yes, yes, uh, yeah, of course, uh, because when we practice Tai Chi Chi Gong, we have to pay attention and listen to our body. You awareness every part of the body, otherwise you, your movement lost of balance. That's why you create a movement, slow movement. You can feel, pay attention to your body. When you know where's the tension, where's the blockage, then you know the root cause, then how you can open up. Then your body naturally just know how to release. It's basic. Uh, like smart chi, do whatever you need. But you have to know, get into yourself, get to know what's going on. That's how your body can heal. Because uh, <laughs> instead of look out the window, look out a magic pill. If the energy get blocked, you don't know where's the block, then you cover up, make it worse. The root cause get worse. That's why Tai Chi Chi Gong is a self-awareness. You get to know the root cause and you can go to the root cause. If people did not do Tai Chi Chi Gong, they don't know the root cause. But we have, like, as a Chinese doctor, we always have to learn from the patient. That's how I get better, because they tell me what's the problem. They have to do it. Then they know where's the blockers, uh, what is all balance. They have to tell me what's going on. That's how they know the root cause through Tai Chi Chi Gong. That's all my patients, they say, chronic illness, say no cure. I say no cure is not true. You can figure it out yourself. If you don't figure it out yourself, of course, no, no, no pill to kill you, to fix the only yeah. symptom forever. That's why we need Tai Chi Chi Gong. Is somebody come to me just looking for Chinese medicine, a magic pill? I'm not gonna take them because it, it's not gonna work. And only two symptom. Either Eastern medicine or Western medicine, same idea. But Qi Gong is important part in my Chinese medicine practice in. China and here for 40 years. And that's the history, the old, that's the old school in Chinese medicine. 70% of 
you have to do Tai Chi Qi Gong and die. You know yourself what's going on yourself. Qi Gong Tai Chi, how you pay attention. That's how you know what energy weak. Your yang deficiency, your body cold, your body not enough sun sign, like yang like the sun, and moon like is a yes, it's yes. A, moon is a yin. And you, you do Tai Chi Qi Gong, you get to know who you are, what kind of energy deficiency. Then you can apply better diet. Is it a mac and run dunking? Everybody new drink milk or everybody drink green tea? Green tea is in. It's actually it's your core already right? drink green tea. Get worse, get worse. You don't pay attention to yourself. You go to the doctor to get prescribed as a blocker, block your stomach. Actually, your stomach not enough young energy to yeah. cold, and you're still doing juice and drink green tea. Actually, you need black tea. Uh, yeah. so that you know that, then you don't need to go to the doctor to, to forever. Take it as a blocker, prescription forever. And then make it more stress too. That's why Tai Chi Chi Gong is help you listen to your body. And when I see them, actually Chinese patients, they say, oh, because they're slow and they pay attention to their body. They say, oh, I got cold stomach because they pay attention when they drink green tea, drink iced tea, or, or juice, they bother them. Or drink milk, bother their stomach. But many people, because they not pay attention to their body and they don't know, and even they, they eat so many things wrong and they don't know which one cause problem. I see, so it's through Qigong and Tai Chi we arrive to be balanced, to balance the yin and the yang in our yeah. body and to really yeah. pay attention, to focus to ourselves. Uh, it's very interesting. And could you tell us a little bit about your practice? Yeah, my practice, that means use where get appointment. Uh, first appointment takes uh, like 90 minutes, more than one hour. And I have to uh, look at their time, ask questions. They have to tell me what's going on, get to know they eat the wrong food or what bother them, what make it worse, what make it better. If they don't know, I have to guess, okay, you might drink too much milk or too much coke. Or I can diagnose somebody with the uh, energy. Energy diagnose is different than Western diagnose from lab tests. Based on, go, based on your energy level, is which channel is weaker or which channel is too strong, and we balance that, or you are too hot or too cold, too much young energy or little young energy. It's too much, you have to release, find a way to release. Yes. That means you need uh, something, uh, Qigong technique to relate or healing, in it, like cupping, release some energy. And also, if you are too weak, or too cold, then you need some tonify like jinxin, warm you up. Like Korean Chinese red jinxin is warm up the body. Like American jinxin is cool on the body. Same plan, but like uh, biochemistry, like pharmaceutical company, like Western MD doesn't believe that because jinxin is jinxin. Main ingredient no different, but the energy different. But I, I have experience and I, I'm... Young with. I'm hundred percent with you. Besides food, too food, you are weak. Then you need some young energy. Need some meat to boost up the young energy. Come by with jinxin, the be the result better than just jinxin. But it did not, uh, not eat the food right. If somebody too much young energy, then you they need vegetarian and uh, vegan. You have to listen to your body instead of everybody on vegan and raw food. Is that my body on fire? Vegan raw food, juicing, fasting and cleansing the toxic can help save my life. But some people, it's like too weak already, too cold and make a mess. And very dangerous, they go hospital, like they go hospital. I said, no, this is uh, like it's too, too, too cold and too much cold food, juice, no more juice, turn around, actually save the life again. Even they say, oh, they die, their heartbeat gonna stop. No more energy, the heart like go near. The heart so weak, heartbeat go 120 and the heart gonna stop. The heart and the kidney gonna stop. Then no more life. The energy gone. This yin and yang they separate. Then the life ended. I see. It's so you have the uh, kidney energy too. You have an overall um, research on the people, so you understand them and you help them to balance through food, through nutrition, through the way they act in life. It's very interesting. And uh, then how long it will take a procedure with you, like, uh, yeah, let's say, they are, like this, the, the hospital, uh, that's, they turn around, energy turn around, next day they feel better, the heartbeat slow down and it's stronger. 
Oh, just uh, like this. You yeah, have you them to balance very really fast. Are, they are in, and even in, in hospital life, they cannot, even cannot eat food. They live with the IV fluid and vitamin sure. protein put in IV. They cannot eat no more because it's so weak. And the next day, they don't need IV they, because they can eat again. Oh, I, I see. It's that very interesting. Thing. Very nice. Uh, like, yeah. like, like, uh, 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 like cancer patient. Like it's cancer day, until usually they get up, some cancer patient take like one year, two year. But still, like, the doctor say, oh, this is chemo, no work day. All over tumor, the pool swear out like ice. That straight all get blocked. They cannot do surgery, they cannot do chemo. Chemo not work. And they say hospice, three months to live. But enough, they live for three years, five years. That kind of case, we say, we don't have to be, be hurried. You, you can live. You live with a problem. That need patient. Some people know patient not going to work. If they, they know patient, that means they stress out more. I say you live with a problem. It's not about a year you live. Sometimes it takes five years, sometimes three years. That kind of chronic condition, you, we can live with cancer. After six years, sometimes they're, all the cancer disappears without treatment. Instead of telling you die three months, how about if you can live? Who knows? Yes. Who knows three months to live? I don't know. <laughs> Wonderful. Say, tomorrow is mystery. I say I die tomorrow. They get more scared. They say I cannot die tomorrow. How do you know die tomorrow? I say, can't he die, die tomorrow? We only have one day today. Tomorrow wake up, I have another tomorrow. Now they are stress relief because they say I have three months. I say three months longer than me. I just <laughs> one year, one day. I need one day only. But you get three months, right? <laughs> yeah, it is so wonderful. Sometimes we are patient too. Sometimes we are patient. You also. Take the people and help them to remove their stress, help them to open to life, to, to see the life the way it is, to calm down, to eliminate panic. Yeah, that's why the Qigong Tai Chi helping me. In the old days, Thai Chinese doctor need required to do Tai Chi Qigong. Why? Because we need to be, get to know ourselves, know other people, know yourself first. Who am I? It's number, uh, number one question in our life. And I learned a lot from listening to everybody. Because Chinese medicine, we have to learn from the patient. Because we learn a lot from the patient, learn what's going on, what make them feel better, what make them force. It's real practical experiment ourselves. Then the patient is go with me for a year, two years, they become doctor themselves. That's why I have no stress. Because they never know what's going on, they never put 100% on me. They only get me say 30%, they are 70%. I never, they, they never give me the stress because they take over the power. They have no stress, I have no stress. I understand. See, like regular doctors have stress because they control the patient. They try to control and nothing they can control because the patient not take all the power, over the power. They don't teach them take the power in how to trust their battle. Then they weaker, weaker, no quality of life. That's why the most uh, doctor stress out, but Chinese doctor, you do Tai Chi Qi Gong, that's called like my body spirit connected. The high level is the spiritual level, but you need get from the body to the mind to the spirit. Then yes. no more stress. Because so they the, get over the power. You fool yourself, you fool the patient. Yes, before building the mind, we need to build the basis, the, the body, to be healthy, to sustain the mind and the spirit. These are yeah, the higher day, level. All the mass of practitioner is a healer. And even Kung Fu Master, we don't need hospital to do surgery. Bukina, Bukina, we set the bone, boom, done. But right now, the problem with Kung Fu School, they don't train it because we China, too, we have too many hospitals, and they have insurance pay for it. They over the surgery. 97% of the broken up, actually, we don't need surgery. If you have good skill, you, you, you can get with 99.9. It's the Chinese doctor or the Kung Fu Master, they don't have good skill. That means, you need 90, only 3% to do surgery. Yeah, yeah, that I mean, you have good skill, go with master, have good skill, then you're still the broken arm, broken leg. You can get with 19.9% .9 of the surgery. After surgery, dangerous because sometimes it can be reaction for a, with any scissor or can be cut something wrong, uh, rest. But go the whole day, go with fighting like this, set the bone, never have any side effect. You set the bone, two weeks, boom, done. But right now, the problem right now, Kung Fu school, they're not doing that no more. I understand. But China that. still, some, 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 some hospitals still do it. But they are lenders from the Saudi Kung Fu master. They're, 
grandparents or great grandparents from learn from the monk in the Southern Temple and they still practice in a Chinese hospital in China. But right now the problem is like going to school, they not keep the culture going. We we lost some part of it. I try to bring it back, tell all the Gong Hu master, Tai Chi master, to take that power back. Because the, the system is problem right now. If you know how to save your life, then you can avoid, cut down the surgery. Of course, we, we, re, re, we have to know, learn how to, when is real case needs surgery, not let them overdo surgery on us. So we can help people through a natural way. Yeah, natural way. Yes, yes, yes. We can go to the history. The history is in China still there. I understand, yeah. I see. Just from studying the old uh, teachings, they can come to a, with a way that they can help people without any medical intervention, like without procedure, modern procedures. Just rebuild the body, repair for a natural way. Yeah, like yes. how you, you don't want to overdo the surgery because it, you take more rest. Rescue. Cost I, more I, think, I think a lot of people, they, they need your help. They need to, to get in contact with you. And how can you be rich? How can people they find you? People find me just, if they go to my website, wuhyun.com, they get my telephone number. If they call or text me, that's how they go. They, uh, they remember my website, that's it, wuhyun.com. And I also know that you are active on Twitter. And